Yo guys, it's Brisky. Here is my 2022 Gaming Sap Tour. So starting off, we have my custom keyboard, the GMM KTKL, with the Echo CS Res Red switches. It's a pretty nice keyboard to be honest. Here is my second, well, my third main keyboard, the Stelsius Apex 7 TKL, the red linear switches. Here's my Logitech G403 Hero. I have to use this mouse again. Um, I'll explain in a little bit. Here's my Corsair mouse pad. I use for like Fortnite and stuff. Here is the modded DK61 with the Garon Optical Blue switches. So, the whole top row, all the switches and stuff are off because nothing will type. Like, if I type 1, it won't type. 2, it won't type. Nothing will type. Like, in this entire top row. And nothing will delete. And the escape key won't work. But it is modded with... Uh, team tape mode. I mean mod. Moving on. Here we have my second main keyboard. The Razer Blackwood V3 Mini. With the yellow linear and silent switches. Very nice keyboard. It's also a Bluetooth keyboard. Oh geez. Um, here we have my uh, Glorious Malo Minus. So the side button actually broke on the mouse about a few hours, a couple hours ago. So I'm gonna get a new gaming mouse soon. Put this back. And here we have the Royal Clutch RK61 with Garon Optical Blue Switches. So I'm thinking about maybe giving this to one of my friends or something. No, I'm kidding. So this keyboard's also broken with the plug-in. It's not in place. So I have to fix that or try to. Here we have the ONN. It has the uh, Cherry MX Blue Switches or Optimo. Blue, I'm not sure. Here we have the Sushi's Apex 3. So, sorry. It's a membrane keyboard, and also we got my office keyboard. Moving on. Let's put this back. Here we got the modded Razer Huntsman Mini with the linear optical switches. Is modded with tape mod with uh, tape mod. But guys, comment if I should do tape mod with the custom keyboard. Here we got the Red Dragon K530 Draconic with the Dustproof Brown switches. So let's move on. Here we got my newer Xbox controller. I don't use it really. I'm I am uh, I might have to fix it or something. Cause every time I'm playing, uh, I want to use my headset with like a mic for like talking to friends and stuff. The controller would turn off. <clears throat> so I don't really use that. Here's the keycap puller for the GMK. Yeah, we just got some keycaps and switches that I don't really need, but I'll keep. <clears throat> on, moving on, we got my Samsung Curved Monitor. I still have this monitor, it's pretty good. Here we got my Xbox One S. It's pretty good, but 
Oops. Very soon, on August 5th, I'm pretty sure, I will have a brand new unboxing video. That's all I can say. I'm pretty sure maybe. Maybe not. But, um, yeah, stay tuned for the channel. Um, that's not all. We have my old mouse pad, the Razer mouse pad. You guys, if you're an OG, you will remember that mouse pad. Down here, we got a... Hold on. Um, all right, let me just put this stuff on my desk. Up, oh, uh, the cord's just caught. Whatever. It is, uh, TTE Sports by... I don't know. Hold on. I can't even read. By... By... Th by thermal, by thermal take, it has, it's not actually a membrane, it actually, well, I think it might be, be but it's not a mechanical keyboard, that, that's all I can say, I mean, I'm trying to do something, here it has a white switch, let me get the space bar. But I got spare keycaps for the, um, from the build of the custom keyboard. Here we have my old Red Dragon mouse pad. It had LED and LED lights by the news. That's it for the SEP tour. I might have a new mouse, maybe. But I won't unbox it until the January 5th unboxing. Uh but I might I might be in school by then. I mean I go back to school January 4th. But hope you enjoyed the SEP tour. Like and sub if you did. Bye bye now. Bye.